Hi, and welcome to a chapter in noise and interference detection at your QTH. I use a Kenwood TS2000 uh, with a NFED and a hex beam antenna. And lately I've noticed uh, a little bit of uh, noise. And it's random noise, so I didn't think it was man-made. And it pops up and then it completely goes away. And it's been really puzzling. And it's very difficult to operate sideband when uh, this static noise is, uh, is around. So uh, I attributed it to uh, local car dealerships that I live near and their uh, lighting systems that they have. But today I decided to take a one step further and try and really investigate it. Here's a sample of the noise. Well, it is pretty annoying, isn't it? Well, enough of that. Now you're probably wondering why I have this little AM transistor radio sitting next to my rig. Well, that's my radio detection unit. <laughs> so you tune it to a station where you get similar noise on the AM radio that you are on your rig. And then you take that little portable radio around to all your appliances and such in the household to try to find out where the noise is coming from. Using a FFT analysis tool or some signal analysis tool that you may have at your fingertips, try and figure out if it's really man-made or natural. If it's a naturally generated uh, noise, it'll, it won't have a periodic nature to it and a random uh, nature it will be rather than periodic. And in this case, it certainly looked like it was random. So I was about ready to give up on doing this analysis, but decided to spend a little bit of time with it today. And lo and behold, uh, my investigation did find the source. So now with a little help from the XYL, I am going to correlate the starting and stopping of the dishwasher with uh, the noise level at my rig. Here we go.